Hello everybody, I hope you are all doing very well and welcome back to another cryptocurrency technical analysis where in today's video we're going to be continuing on with the Bitcoin Steam Train and a Fibonacci Masterclass. Uh, just seeing these levels respected time and time again is honestly amazing and um, yeah, hope that you thoroughly enjoy this video and it can be educational for you. Um, so yeah, let's go on, let's go on, let's go on. So what have we seen from yesterday, okay? So obviously this was the... Uh, cheat sheet that I gave you all over on Twitter um, saying, you know, here, here you go, here's the most important resistance levels calculated using Fibonacci, okay, and obviously we were looking there at the 0 0.5 Fibonacci level sat at 11,477, okay. <clears throat> And as you can see today, oh, really nice what's going on here. Uh, but as you can see, we literally, literally uh, hit the uh, 0 0.5 Fibonacci. Obviously, we were within this parallel channel yesterday while looking at that target. We break up from the parallel channel, hit that 0 0.5 Fibonacci, get a rejection. And guess where we rejected to? At the top of the parallel, old resistance flipping into support. Another move up for that potential double top at this point um, before, you know, moving down slightly again here. But um momentum and power is definitely with the bulls at this point um you know we just have to always look at everything as a as an unbiased viewpoint okay and uh you know clearly the 0 0.5 is acting as resistance here it's come up for a double you know a potential double top at this point uh for another rejection but you know holding support okay so i always look at this we are hitting resistance so we are running <laughs> the move is, is is undeniably due a pullback but uh at the moment the, the uptrend is still intact Okay, and supports are still being held. So, although yes, a pullback is is due, that's undeniable. Uh, while we still hold supports, the pullback is not coming. Okay, and then you have to like make do for the um, you know pullbacks of old resistance flipping into support. This was a long every single day of the week for me. Um, yeah, you know taking profit 0 0.5 adding back on and then you obviously move up for a double top and now it's like reviewing it as it comes along for example we're on the four hour here okay we'll come along to the four hour and we can say you know are we closing out this four hour with it there's still another two hours 48 left so are we closing out the um four hour with a double top here okay and then we can come and look down to test some lower levels or actually do we you know three hours two hours here left you know push on through this resistance um Overall, though, like for a real unbiased view, I will just give you like the key levels I'd be looking at. Okay, so for support, you know, clearly this is this is your you know main critical support here, eleven thousand one hundred. So eleven thousand one hundred, a a you know a a a a closer term support. Okay, down to. 10,500 for your lower support, okay? Obviously, the 382 here sits at 9,800. So, um, it's uh, a important line. Uh, but then, obviously, to the upside for the resistances, likewise, um, you know, consolidation, <laughs> it can still consolidate under these resistances, which in the past has been breaking through, although we are overextended. Um, you would nevertheless be looking at 11,500, which we basically got rejected from today. Okay, moving up to 11,800. And obviously the monthly here is sat at 13,000, say 14,000. So, um, you know, this whole region of monthly slash golden pocket right there. Uh, strong resistance is up ahead. And um, yeah, all, all I would say, well, like, when you view this trend overall, like, undeniably it is due a pullback it's just um there are so many people i believe wanting to get into this market on the sidelines that sometimes these pullbacks are are not given but you know you know looking at it with like unbiased sort of just views like really really simply are we holding supports do we drop through supports if you drop through supports you don't look down for obviously naturally lower supports so um you know just just trade the chart how it's given you and you know don't hope for pullbacks don't hope for increases just you know trade with the trend and trade with the charts it's really simple as that um so yeah, that was Bitcoin and the most important levels and just like perfect how we, we, we bounced off that 0 0.5 there. Um, and I would like to also cover Link today because Link has also been a nice one. Um, I'll, I'll let you know that I'm mainly still only trading Bitcoin. Okay, so Bitcoin is like my baby at the moment. That is like my whole focus is on Bitcoin, uh, not actually on altcoins. But like obviously you look, you look through the board. Altcoins very much red today. V chain obviously with its pump, uh, ontology with a slight movement and link here. So those are the the three that I'll really quickly cover. Um, so we're looking obviously here at the uh, link. Sorry, so link from its its low to the high. Okay, coming down to that golden pocket, getting another extension. You know, another move from that golden pocket. Really, really nice to see. If I take off of this, you know, just like Bitcoin, here's a parallel channel. Here's what we were trading within. You break upwards. Okay, we come back down, hold that old resistance into the support, and you get a move back up. Also coinciding with that golden pocket from low to high. So like link, really, really, really nice. Okay, and then we look at V chain. <laughs> this was all to do with the. Um, 
this was all to do with the Walmart news. So there was like a rumor that VeChain are partnering with Walmart or something. And obviously that sends it crazy high in a matter of about an hour there. You see like a, you know, 50, 50 60% rise, like absolutely crazy. Was not buying this, by the way. So I, I just to, to reiterate, I'm, I'm just going through these ones. I have not traded because uh, I've only been trading Bitcoin. So um just want you to be aware that I'm just covering this now for helping out. But yeah, this this was uh, yeah a V chain pump. Obviously, if you had been accumulating at lower regions, well done. But if you're buying on a, on on the pump of, of a news, then you always have to be careful because then you see here like a 20 percent you know 20 percent sell off straight away. So feel sorry for anybody fomoing into this one because that has definitely not ended well. Okay, then you obviously see on the likewise on ontology has held itself a little bit better. Obviously, ontology that again six one eight pump. Okay, moving down and pumps, and this was obviously all in today. So you see that move up, give it all pretty much back before another a, a secondary move up. But um, overall, like my main focus definitely is on Bitcoin. Like undeniably, is on Bitcoin. And while we still hold these key supports levels, I would naturally expect us to move on still. <laughs> uh, it's only like when we start to break down from like key supports, then you would imagine, obviously, you look, look, look down towards lower levels. OK, so, um, you know, just just, you know, just always it's about confirmation. Do you want to be uh, shorting this uptrend at the moment, like jumping in front of it? If you do, then obviously you're just going to have to use like tight stops, like, for example, just a really quick example. If you wanted to be shorting, then obviously you could short this double top stops above, you know, just just something like that. You want to have a, a stop loss set if you're shorting because the momentum, uh, although, yeah, a short is going to come and you can get a really, really, really nice short entry. Uh, but, you know, you want to, well, personally, I want to wait for some confirmation for a short. And when you see a rejection that's then pulled up straight away for a double top within a matter of hours, then that, you know, <laughs> um, isn't looking too good for a shorter right now. OK, you want to wait for a, a big high volume sell off to come. OK, and then join in with that or wait for a you know a confirmation to enter a short because right now the trend is bullish okay but we're well aware that a pullback is due okay so final words oh yeah really really nice that legend nano x has got that um well i need to actually read through this fully but i literally saw this as i was about to start the video so i just wanted to um, just highlight this to you all that ledger x have got a i believe some source of futures contract which is actually derived by uh real bitcoin so that's really really nice really really bullish for the space uh always good news um that sort of news is always good news so um yeah that's really really nice keep your eyes on those support levels that i've mentioned and uh, yeah happy trading hope that you have thoroughly enjoyed this video and um yeah honestly thank you so much everybody and i will just like i'm never ever 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 gonna put any more attention to this but just be aware that for some unknown reason i have a lot of people liking to troll me and um just dislike everything that i do and put so many hate comments on the videos and my tweets etc and um yeah i'm actually gonna hire somebody that's just gonna be moderating this like i don't even have time to waste on it i like I'm not affected by it, but just I'm going to hire someone to go through this and moderate uh, like the YouTube and, and Twitter and things. But yeah, there's so many haters at the moment and it's just crazy. Like all I'm doing is helping people out, trying my best to help people. And like people are so hateful. I, you know, I just want to help. And, you know, I just kind of find, find it kind of mind blowing. But nevertheless, uh, I know the majority are good. So don't, don't think don't think that I'm getting like held down by this. But um, yeah, hate is, hate is going to hate, I guess. <laughs> um, so, yeah, just be careful of somebody hating, hating comments that you see because I'm unaffected by it. But um, yeah, I just wanted to give that last bit of acknowledgement to it before I just don't care <laughs> so yeah i know the majority of are, are, are absolutely you know wonderful thank you honestly so much and you know all the people you know you're more than more than more than welcome you know i'm, I'm happy to help you and you know alert you to these levels etc and um yeah overall enjoy your trading bitcoin is extremely extremely nice be by bitcoin uh love you all thank you everybody so much have a brilliant evening and enjoy yourself with these trades and um yeah you never never lose money taking profit i'll end with that cheers everybody thank you bye <laughs>